Dragon Lord's lair. Dragon's Maw. This is where my dad and the Dragon Lord. This isn't over, Crimson Wizard. You ain't getting away this time! That one was on me! You can't run! Buy some new equipment. Watch out! Here she But you may not proceed. Give up, Duran. The Dragon Lord has never been more powerful. You don't stand a chance. You think you can tell me what to do, huh? <laughs> don't act like you know me. You don't know anything. I ain't running away from the monster that killed my dad! You still don't know who I am. I am Loki. Your father. No. What are you saying? It doesn't make any sense. My father died during the fight with the Dragon Lord. During the fight? I was plunged into the abyss. The Dragon Lord saved my broken body with his dark power. Now I live to serve him. Come. Come to me, my son. For I have missed you, Duran. <laughs> Dad? You tricked me! Not so. I merely wanted to extract your soul to grant you dark power as well. Now, come with me. I knew you couldn't be my father. He was strong and kind. You're nothing like Loki! The Golden Knight! Pity. But if that is your wish... I cannot let you live. Why does it have to be my dad? Behold, the Dragon Lord's power of darkness. Without darkness, you cannot hope to become the strongest. Shut it! I ain't gonna rely on darkness to gain power. I'll stop you. With my own strength! Can you withstand? 
so strong, strong enough to free my soul from the Dragon Lord's curse. Be on your guard. He is more powerful than ever before. Curses. I have to go, Duran. Do not stray from the Swordmaster's path. Your sword is a reflection of your soul. Never lose yourself. Dad, wait. Dad, I won't waver. Dragon Lord will not get away with what he's done. He and the Crimson Wizard are through. And we'll stop them. And I'll make you proud. Mom and Dad, let's go! Huh? Just take it out! The sword does more damage! That stinks! Don't keep me waiting! Come on! 
monster from Dwarf Tunnel, huh? Easier to get my head in the game with this one. Let's go! Curses! They just keep coming! We'll beat this one so hard, it'll never get up again! <laughs> Okay, leave it to me. Shadow Man. Over here. Garland, What a waste. No, no, This should do it. up and be on our way. Yeah! <laughs> 
retreat! I don't have time for this. Stop! Bye! Impressive. You have made it far, but you are too late nonetheless. Thanks to you, the Dragon Lord will transform into his final complete form, using the combined powers of all eight Benevadons. I don't care who I'm up against. <laughs> I won't back down. You're all finished! Give me back my mother! Oh, unfortunately, that's impossible. You see, once the Dragon Lord is fully reformed, I'll offer the True Queen's life force to him. She will be a suitable sacrifice to my master. You wouldn't. Oh, my. You are a rude bunch. It is of no consequence, though. There is nothing you can do now. Submit to the end of the world. Uh, 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 uh,
on me.
You must be the Dragon Lord. <laughs> you never learn. <laughs> None of this matters in the end. But as you are all present, feast your eyes on the dawning of a new age as I become a god. <laughs> this is the very last of the Sword of Mana. No! It's gone! <laughs> the power of the destroyed Benevidons has been absorbed by the sword. It has now corrupted it beyond recognition. Now that power is mine. The Dragon Lord will rise again! Venerable Master, you have surpassed even the Goddess of Mana herself! You are more than a god! You are a supreme god! Uh, my lord? Goddess of Mana! That useless weakling! How can she still be alive? Fine. If she wishes for death, I shall destroy the goddess at her source, the Tree of Mana. Let us be off to the sanctuary. Please, go on ahead, my lord. I will rid us of these pests. Do not delay. Get rid of us, huh? Try it. I dare ya. I've gotten so much stronger since the first time we met. And this? <laughs> this is the moment I've been waiting for. I've come this far in order to defeat you! Very well. You will soon understand how defenseless you are. In the face of the power of darkness, I will show you myself! <laughs> Bow down to the power of the Dragon Lord, just as your father did! <laughs> you know, I should thank you, Crimson Wizard. Since that day you beat me, I've been getting stronger. <laughs> but can you imagine how much stronger you can become? If you give your life to the Dragon Lord, like your father before you. Shut your mouth! You think that's all my father, Loki the Golden Knight, was worth? Your sword is a reflection of your soul. The Golden Knight is a protector. You don't know your own strength. Until you have something to protect. Someone like you never understand true strength. Beautiful. Your sword is powerless before the might of the Dragon Lord! Time for you to understand your worthlessness! <laughs> I'll show you power! Right here! Right now! <laughs> Don't keep me waiting! Water! <laughs> you think you can beat me? Well done! Come on! Will you survive? That one was not bad! You can not it! Oh, that sticks! Dark power triumphs! That one was not bad! You think you can beat me? Over me! That one was on me! You can do it! Okay, this is me! This power is insane! This rate! Whoa! That must be the source of the power! 
long as we destroy it! How dare you! Come 
Can't even stand up. This is as far as evil power will take you. When I was younger, I was unable to use magic. Ashamed at my own powerlessness and disgusted with my lot in life, I fled Altena. I traveled far and finally arrived at Dragon's Maw. The battlegrounds where the famed Golden Knight of Valsena fell to the Dragon Lord. There I came across what remained of my master's body. But my master was not gone completely. His spirit spoke to me from that decaying body. He offered me a deal in exchange for half of my life force. I was given control of the Dragon Lord's limitless power. However, my life force only served to partially revive him. But the Dragon Lord is infinitely cunning. He devised a plan to gain the powers of the Benevidons using the Mana Sword in order to regain his true form. Soon the Dragon Lord will be at full power. I only have half my life as it is. The dark power given to me can't replace what he took of my life force. I will never be whole. <laughs> is there even a reason to go on? Of course there is. Don't just give up. You don't have to end it here. <laughs> I thank you, Duran. Fool. Dark power drove him to this. It's sad, but we don't have much time left. We have to get back to the sanctuary and protect the goddess. She's still in danger. If the tree of mana dies, mana dies with it. We don't have the sword anymore. But we can't give up. Please, I need you to help the goddess of mana. Angela? Where are we? Oh, have you been skipping Jose's lessons again? My dear, you shouldn't antagonize your loyal subjects. Remember, you will be Queen of Altena someday. I know that it's hard, especially if magic doesn't come easily for you. 
but you can take all the time you need to learn it. I pray to the goddess of mana every day, asking for her blessings, so that you may learn magic faster. Mother. Oh, mother. What's wrong, Angela? There's no need for you to cry. Oh, but please introduce me to your friends. something so horrible has happened. I don't remember any of it. How could a queen allow such madness? Even if I was being controlled, the idea that I would try to sacrifice my own daughter is terrifying. I am thoroughly ashamed. Please forgive me, Angela. No, I... <sighs> it's okay, Mother. You're still the true queen, and your people love you. I love you. Please, continue to rule over Altena fairly, as you always have. We have to go to the Sanctuary of Mana now, and fight the Dragon Lord. But, I'll see you when this is over, Mother. Thank you, Angela. You must go to the Sanctuary without delay. The portal is sealed shut for all but you three, and your fairy companion. It is up to you. Please be careful, and return to this realm safely. <laughs> 